According to a recent study by MIT, 95% of AI projects fail. Most of these exist in the cloud. How did that happen? Let's talk about it. Hey Dave, Tim Crawford with Avoa and the host of the CIO in the Know podcast here in Park City, Utah. And I just wanted to take a minute and congratulate you on hitting 200,000 subscribers on YouTube. It's quite an accomplishment. And here's to the next 100,000. Well, welcome to the Cloud Computing Insider. My name is Dave. Let's get started. So this is from a story that dropped uh, last month, August, uh, wherever you're reading this, August of 2025. And so it's about 30 days old or whatever. And I reported on it on my other channel, Dave is not AI. But it's interesting to look at the cloud computing angle of this. <laughs> and suddenly, you know, I did some deeper dives in what this study meant uh, in terms of AI failure. And it really reflects, I think, poorly on enterprises' ability to be, to be successful with cloud platforms. And I think the fault falls on both the cloud platform providers, which I think could do a better job, and also some of the enterprises that are leveraging cloud. So the news that 95% of enterprises have AI projects that fail, this according to a recent MIT study, and I think this is a wake-up call for organizations. You know, from my perspective, the core issues lie less in technology or infrastructure and more in how companies approach AI development and deployment. Again, by relying primarily on public cloud providers, many enterprises face challenges in coordinating data and aligning outcomes with business goals. 